Uh, so what's up guys this is your boy Nick uh, from 3D Animation Guru and uh, welcome back to another tutorial and this time uh, this is on February I would like to take you the, through the Unreal Engine and I was not doing for a long time the tutorial about the Unreal Engine because I just wanted to know how to be able to operate with Unreal Engine Guru so I was just doing some research and I try to look for the, uh, the problem that so many people face when they are using the Unreal Engine. And I decided that this is now the time when I have to start this tutorial, which might take uh, a couple of weeks. And this tutorial will be not be tackling everything about the Unreal Engine. So I just want to consider on the, uh, the easiest way how you can just get started with the Unreal Engine, the problem that you face with the Unreal Engine. And things that you should know about the Unreal Engine that will make you not just, you know, there's a very long process, like there are so many video, but so many people, they don't explain to you uh, everything from A to Z. So my big main reason for doing this tutorial is to make Unreal Engine easier. Like you can be using it and be able now to do your project without any problem. So that's why I decided that it's a good idea that uh, I can show you guys how to do this. And I hope that you're going to learn something and I just uh, expect that you're going to subscribe because I'll be doing every day I have to upload a video and show you how you can be able to do this. So uh, that was just a small introduction and right now I'll just like with the first thing that we can do when we start uh, using the Unreal Engine because we can't have an Unreal Engine if we don't install it. And right now, like you can see on my page, I have this the Unreal Engine 5, Early Access, which uh, it's just like this other, like the Unreal Engine 4. It's only that this one is advanced, but this one, uh, this one is not already yet uh, released. But I will just show you this one, and when they just release, I will just uh, have to download it, and then I can just show you how to use it. So most of the time, I'm just going to use Unreal Engine 4.26, which I also think is uh, more likely like the Unreal Engine 5. Only some few features which have been changing. And the basic thing, they are always the same in this engine. So they just uh, do some advancement and then they can show you everything. So let's get started. So the first thing you need to know about Unreal Engine, if you just want to get it, what you just need to do is that you need to go to the internet. And you just light uh, Unreal Engine uh, 5. Just light Unreal Engine 5 or Unreal Engine 4, which is that, that you want to have. This is not an issue. And then just click this page here. Let me just go back and now it's just now going to open for you the page that we uh, were having this page here so where you have the Unreal Engine and now they can just try to give you some information the introduction to Unreal Engine 5 and there are so many things here go that you can just check on your and just try to lead it but on this tutorial, we just go to take the point. First thing we just need to do is that we have the products, we have the solution and everything. Then we have the learning material, we have the community support. Like you can just join some people here. You have the epic mega grant that you can now just apply and then use it for your project. You have the marketplace where you can just buy your app, things that you can use them on the Unreal Engine. And here you have like sign in, then you have the language, like you have the Japanese, Korea, and then simplified Chinese. But we are going to use English as our main language. Then you have like you can just come here and sign in if you just click sign in. So what is just going to happen? It will just open you and give you some option like you can just sign in using the, let's see what is just going to happen. I'm experiencing a bad day with my internet, but... Uh, I hope it's not just going to let us down. So, now, like you can see here, uh, you, it just asks you to choose what you just want to sign in with. You can sign in using the Epic Game, Facebook, uh, Gmail. Xbox, uh, uh, PS5, or anything, even with Apple. I use uh, Google to sign in. That is for me easier. So when you're now done signing, now what you just need to come and do is to download this one here. Just click download. 
and when you just click download you would have the two licenses you have the publisher license and you have the creator license i don't think it did <laughs> It, it, this one I have never came to understand the reason why they have the two because you can just download in a, in of them, and when you're just going to download what you just download is not the Unreal Engine. You just download something we call the Epic Game Launcher, something that looks like this one. This thing you can also find it on your desktop. I have it here, the Epic Game Launcher, and then when you just have it, now you see now you have the Unreal Engine 4. You have the learning. You have the marketplace. You have the library, you have the twin motion, and then you have the Unreal Engine 5. So now here is now where you have everything that you need for Unreal Engine. So you just need to come here, you have to sign in, like you can see I'm already signed in. And then when you sign in, it just ask you just for the steps. Like uh, when you just install it, it just ask you to sign in, just sign in like the same way I showed you here with the Google or with the Apple, whatever you used. And then when you are done, now you have this one here, you have the Unreal Engine 5 and you have the library. So for those people who just want to go direct to the Unreal Engine 5, you can just click here and then just say that you want to download the Unreal Engine Early Access, which is already um, right now that yeah, the one that we have, it is not already the full version, is the Early Access. So what just happened is that if you just now want to download just go back to the library when you just so because this one you just selected the library or let me just click this one here and show you something just click download because it's not going to download here it will just bring you back and like you can see here you have those two fashions here of the early region 4.25 which i like the most it's, it doesn't have the clashing uh, issues and then you have the unreal agent 4.26 so if you just want to add any new version, just click here and now you have Unreal Engine 4.27. So if you just want to download this on the Unreal Engine 4.25, you just need to click here. Then just click the same way like I showed you. Just download. This one just have to take some seconds. And now you see now you can you have the Unreal Engine 5.2.0.0, uh, 5 which just want to be installed. Just click install ask you here you just want to uh, to create the browser or whatever then you have the option and on this option if you just want to download you just have to remove this one you don't need the targets like you just don't need the target platform this one and then you don't need that one and also you don't need the ios so just remove for this one because this one just going to take for you a very long time and then it's just calculating the requirement uh storage then just click apply and then click install and then it's just going to say install the launcher yeah and now you see now you can just start downloading your unreal agent 5.0 then if you go to the download this is also just going to show you exactly what is just happening on your downloads you can either pause if you are if it takes too long to download or you can also cancel the installation so that's why you start so the first thing I would just like you to do is that you can just download any of those versions. Just go download Unreal Agent 5.25 or Unreal Agent 4 5.26 or Unreal Agent 5.00 or you can just download Unreal Agent uh, 4.27. You can just come here and install one of this one here. So from there then we are just going now to take another step. We are just going to show you exactly how to start learning it. And the problem that you uh, you just experienced for this first time that you're opening the Unreal Engine, any of those fashion because they are those things. So thank you guys for watching this video, and I hope that you learned something. So first of all, you just download this version, and then we see us tomorrow, as we are now going to start uh, using those uh, project. So thank you guys, and hope to see you next on my next video. So bye bye for now.